since we've had that done, I figured I'd show you around, give you a new updated tour of the salon. Um, I did change up the entrance of the salon space, so I decided to mix up the waiting area. So I have a shampoo bowl over here, and I'm sorry, not a shampoo bowl. <laughs> I have a dryer chair over here, uh, along with our waiting area. And we have our reception desk and another dryer station here. And then I changed up um, my area over here. I actually decided to add another hair station. So I have two hair stations here now. I used to have a makeup counter with three chairs. So we demoed the makeup counter and I added an extra hair styling station and I moved one makeup counter over here to help um, take care of my bridal team when they come in to service trials. A lot of times our girls are always on location, so I still wanted one station to keep here when we have trials that we could take care of everybody. So it just kind of opened up the space and then I added this um, little mini styling table for my extension services. So a lot of you know I do specialize in hair extensions, so I needed a counter space to paint um, and color hair extensions to blow dry. And I even added these little magnetic strips on the side here. And it's stuck with double-sided tape. And these are awesome. So I could redo all my strings on my needles and I just tap them here and they all hang. So for all there, that way everything is prepped for all my services for the day. So this has been great. And come on this way. And here I still have my reception area. Um, we keep a lot of storage for our products in here. And we have our retail shelf as well. Um, I had this made. I wanted something that was a little mid-century modern to be slender, because obviously the size of my salon is smaller. It's about 1,300 square feet, so it's like long and skinny. I wanted enough space for stylists to work, but clients can still walk through. So I had this made, and um, like I said, it's very slender, but it holds all our lovely products. We can come on this way. And since I've last seen you, we only had two shampoo bowls, but I added a third shampoo bowl, because um, things just got busy, and it was time for a refresh, and we needed more bowls to cater to more clients and more stylists that have been working here in the salon. And since my last video, we did update um, the wall and we did some beautiful wallpaper, um, which I love, just to kind of add some character to the space. But the shampoo bowls have been great. Super, super happy with the shampoo bowls, the extra shampoo bowl. We have the waiting space for more clients here and our salon stations. Um, everything is very streamlined. I wanted a very minimalistic, clean, um, station so I wanted all the stylists all their things and color and tools to be able to put away nice and clean and here we go looks great um, and then here we have our break room welcome to the clean break room before all the chaos begins for the work week right I would say the one cool thing that we did add into the break room, which I think is a must, whether you have a studio suite or you own a salon, is this. And I got this on Amazon and I can link it in the bio, but it's basically a bottle cleaner. So I'll show you what this does. You put your bottles here and you go like this. And then that way you're able to get out all the colors. So you can say goodbye to having to use these gross things to have to clean out all the junk. This is awesome. It has been a lifesaver. Everybody loves it. Super easy to install and it's been great. And I would, oh, let's see, we got the fridge. Um, I do have a tankless water heater system that's separate from the building. So just in case if there are any water issues with the building and getting hot water, I wanted um, our water to be separate. So this filters our shampoo bowls uh, only, which has been great because we've had issues with city work outside of the salon. The building itself has other tenants and restrooms that sometimes have leaking problems. So 
Um, our hot water has been turned off, but it's been great to have this, so our hot water is always secured. I come on this way. And here we have our little restroom. And we also got this wallpapered since I've uh, lasted our salon tour. Kind of add some nice character to the space, keep everything nice and clean. And we store all of our capes behind the door um, for clients to use. But yeah, thank you so much for following along on our tour for Vela Grace Salon here in Southern California. Uh, within the salon here, we specialize in color, uh, hair extension services. Yeah, we have a full, uh, full space of talented hairstylists. So if you have any questions about anything in my salon, anything you want to know, any, any of the um, chairs, stations, anything that you are interested in knowing what I carry, um, comment below and I'll make another video with more details for you. But thanks for coming along and I'll show you the way out.